Hey there, drone fans. Rick here again from Drone Valley. Well, I did it to myself. Yesterday, I put a clip together talking about the Mavic and how much I love flying it and all the cool things I do with that Mavic. And then last night, I got about a million emails from you guys, and I counted them saying, oh, you're talking about the Mavic and the Phantom. What about the Spark? We love the Spark. You don't talk about the Spark enough. You got me. So today, on the eighth day of Christmas, Drone Valley gave to me a goodie bag for my Spark. Are you kidding me? That's right. We're going to take care of you Spark Flyers as well. I love this quad. I still can't get past the fact that DJI is able to cram so much technology into a tiny little package. I fly this thing a ton. It's one of my favorite quads to take to a party or when I'm out there for a quick afternoon to get it up in the air and get some selfie shots. Fantastic. I love the motion control and all the rest of that stuff. Just an amazingly cool quad. You guys agree because it's insanely popular and I think this thing is going to blow up come Christmas. It's the perfect stocking stuffer for a lot of families that are looking for a quad that kind of want to get started. This is the guy you want to buy. So I thought, I've been flying it ever since it came out and there's some cool stuff you can add to it to make it a little safer, a little more fun. Why don't I put a goodie bag together? And that's exactly what I'm doing. So everything on this table is accessories that can be used with the Spark that'll actually make it safer to transport it, safer to fly it, a lot more fun to fly it, and you're getting them all free of charge. So let me go through what you get. Just like with the Mavic, the Spark has almost zero ground clearance. That concerns me because the camera's in the front and on the bottom. You land this thing on dirt, you're going to get dirt in it. You land it on grass, you're going to get water in it. So unless you're hand catching it, you need some way to get it up off the ground. I'm including a ground clearance kit right here, which gives you about an inch and a half worth of clearance, takes it up off the ground, and you can safely land it in pretty tall grass and not have an issue. But I'm not only including that kit, I'm including this kit over here, which has both the ground clearance to it, and it's got prop guards on it. So you can use this one, you can use that one. It's up to you. You can use whichever one you want. I'm also including a full set of four blades. These are aftermarket blades. They look and work just like the blades that are on there. So if you break a blade, you lose a blade, you've got an extra set of blades. I'm also including the parabolic reflector for the remote control. I'm here to tell you those things are fantastic. And I know a lot of people out there say, oh, it's kind of screwy science, Rick. It doesn't really work. It works. I'm an engineer. I've tested it. I've used RF meters against it. It'll increase your signal strength, which means you can not only fly further with the Spark if you're using a remote controller, but you get better signal strength when you're in close, when you're around objects like trees and buildings and all that other stuff. So slide these over the antennas of your remote controller. Make sure that the power blocks are facing away from you because I've seen video clips where the guys have them facing towards them and they won't work that way. Face them away from you. But these slide over the top of them. They work great. They'll fold up nice and tight throw them in your case and you're good to go. I'm also including a propeller stabilizer. What that does for you, I've got one on here, is it locks those propellers in place because if you don't have that on there, slide this thing down inside of a bag, those propellers are going to get bent and broken. That'll protect you. I've also included two gimbal assemblies. Now the one of them is a gimbal lock which I've got on there now. You don't get a gimbal lock with this which is kind of crazy because that gimbal is really fragile. You throw this thing in a bag, you're going to bang that gimbal up. This gimbal lock slides over the front. Couldn't be easier. Just pop it on there. Protects your gimbal. When you're flying, you may want a sun shield because just like with the Mavic, you've got that lens out in the front. If there's sun to either side of you, it's going to wash across the lens and flare up. This goes on there and gives you those blinders on the sides and on the top and the bottom to knock down some of that sun flare. It's the same thing you'd use on a DSLR camera when you're out there in the sun. You've got a on the front of it, so that's good. I'm including a filter kit. There's a, a mix of filters in here that pop on the front of the Spark unit, and it'll give you sort of ND protection. It'll give you, um, you know, all kinds of different filter settings and stuff in there. If you're a professional photographer, you know what I'm talking about. I know I'm rambling a little bit here, but these filters are really, really cool, and they'll pop on the front. And then the last thing I'm including is a charger for it. So if you've got uh, you're going to a particular location and you want to charge up your Spark batteries, it's a uh, car charger for you. Just plug it in your 12-volt adapter, connects right up to the battery, and you can either charge your Spark directly with another charger or you can charge the battery directly with this one. So it gives you a lot of flexibility. There's also an extra port in there that you can use for USB to charge up something else like your phone or your tablet or even the Spark itself when you're traveling. So the kit itself is a fantastic set of goodies. These are all accessories that I've reviewed, and I'll put links below where you can go to the actual review of these accessories. And I use them myself. That's the important thing because there's a million accessories in the market. Every company out there is building something cool for this quad. They're not all that good, and I don't review ones that I don't like. So if I test something and it stinks, and a lot of them stink, you're not going to see a clip from me. This stuff works, this is stuff I use, and stuff I endorse. So you're going to love getting this stuff. Whether you own the Spark now, you're getting it for Christmas, maybe you're getting it after Christmas, who knows? You're going to get these accessories. Contest couldn't be simpler. Down the bottom, there's a link. If you click that link, it'll take you to a form. You fill it out. Just put your email in there. After a week's time, I'll pull a winner out randomly from the group that I get. I'll eliminate all those emails. I delete those as soon as the contest's over, so you don't have to worry about me badgering you. That'll enter you into the contest. No strings attached. There's no hoops to jump through. No shenanigans. Nothing else going on. Just enter it. Seven days later, I'm shipping this to somebody. And again, I don't care where on the planet you live. Right? I've said this before. I've made jokes about it. 
We have viewers from all over the globe. I want to make sure that if you win this, you'll get this stuff free of charge. I'm putting it in a box and shipping it to you. Again, no strings attached. If you want to increase your chances of winning, there's four other ways you can do that. Subscribe to the channel. You can subscribe to our newsletter. You can download the Roku application and watch our channel on Roku. That's a pretty cool thing that I'm experimenting with. And then last but not least, you can join our Patreon group. That one's going to cost you a buck a month or something like that. But don't worry about that. If you don't want to do that, don't do that. But if you want to, there's another entry for you. So if you've done all of those things before, you're already in this entry. So you're already in the contest, I should say. You don't have to do it again. But you still have to hit the link below to enter the contest. And that's pretty much it. So... I love doing these contests, and I know I get a little wacky around Christmas time, and I thought to myself, maybe I won't continue to sing. And then I read some of the comments, and I got a guy like Pat Lucas, uh, Hell's Favorite Angel Mike, and Charlie Lord all saying, hey, dude, you're singing pretty good, so thanks to you, I'm going to continue to sing. We have a couple more of these coming up. I've got some really, really cool stuff coming, so stay tuned to the channel. Do us a favor and subscribe, because again, the more subscribers I've got, the better we look to companies when I ask them to review some of their stuff. But most importantly... I want you to have a wonderful holiday season because I'm in a really good mood and I've had a fantastic year and it's because of you guys that I'm enjoying this so much, this hobby so much. So thanks again for watching. Until next time, happy flying.